go back to 60 seconds, I'm going to beat this game. If it kills me, I will beat it on little boy mode. We're gonna do this. I didn't get hardly any food. That probably is the only downfall here. But other than that, I got the Boy Scout, I got the axe, the gun. I didn't get the flashlight. Okay, so I didn't get the flashlight and I didn't get enough food. But I got everything else. That's awesome. And the map was already down here. That's so awesome. I'm not reading any of this junk. Let's go. Uh, nobody needs anything because we got the Boy Scout manual. We're a regular family, so we have the occasional argument or two, but it was never as intense as the fight we just got into. Guys, it's day one! You literally are just- why are you drawing people stabbing each other? Seriously, you guys need help. How am I- how am I ever gonna beat this game if y'all can't even get along for five seconds? Uh, yeah, we're going out on an expedition. Hello, are you kidding me? We heard something about supply drops on the radio. That was fast. Um, yes. Go check it out. Cause I got the gas mask. <coughs> Excuse my coffee, and I'm still sick. Oh, we got more food! Yes! Mary Dream. Mary Dream. Alright, everybody needs something to drink. Which is fine, cause we have lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of water. And we're gonna send Mary Jane, my number one out there, with the gas mask so she doesn't die. Where's the gas mask? There it is. Alright, Mary Jane. You got the gas mask, so you're not gonna get sick this time. I got you. I remembered. We got this. Let's go. Ooh, something needs to be done about our interior. What? Interior decoration? What are we gonna do about our interior decoration with a gun? We found a secret door. What's behind it? There's only one way to find out. Sure. Why not? Oh, this is gonna end badly. Oh, please. Okay, the gun's still okay, so I guess nothing lost. We figured the best way to be sure nothing and no one jumps us inside the mysterious room was to bash the door open and start firing. <laughs> when smoke was gone, we were able to assess our operation, the room was empty, we hit nothing but walls, and we barely dodged one ricochet gone bad. Yeah. And Timmy needs to eat, but everybody else is fine. Okay, well Timmy, you'll, you'll be fine for a day. You'll be alright. Da, 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 da. We have to leave eventually. Yada 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 yada. Yeah, let's make contact with the military. Sure. Doesn't the military like steal your stuff and kill you? In this scenario, I don't. Timmy is hungry. Everybody's hungry. We just need to wait for further instructions. Okay, so I guess we're going down the military road today, and everybody needs food. Mary Jane, you really need to come back, girl. Hey, Mary Jane's back, but she is tired and needs food. But she brought food! Oh! Dolores feels better. See? Talking out your issues is the best. Our expedition reached a church, which was still standing. Most of it was intact, and some people decided to turn it into a shelter. As we found out, it was more than that. We weren't sure what religion they followed, but they were very eager to convince us that tomatoes are the source of all evil and eggplants are the only hope for salvation. Those nice people gave us some canned some tomato soup! They're going to give us their evil food. Cultists decided they wouldn't be needing any holy water. We did a bit of miracle work and turned empty wine bottles into quite full water bottles. We got more water. We got a flashlight. One of the beds in the surviving church quarters was filled with quite a few treasures, namely a flashlight and a collection of books about evolution. We took the flashlight. Good plan. Uh, Mary Jane needs food. Timmy needs Dude, I just gave you food yesterday. Okay, everybody needs water, and Timmy and her need food. Whatever, whatever. We got plenty of water, it's alright. Ring, ring, there we were, thinking we could never hear a telephone signal again, when suddenly a phone starts ringing from somewhere outside. Get out there and answer it, Dolores. Day 10. This is going so much better than my usual 60 second videos go. Oh, we could hear a gasp of relief, yes, yeah, the twins. Yep, they'll call us back. Dolores is back. Mary Jane needs more food. Everybody else is fine. 
Mary Jane, you earned it. You eat some food, girl. Yeah, we're going on the next edition. The problem is simple. If we don't wash ourselves, we'll get sick. Seriously sick. It smells really bad down here and doesn't seem like it'll get any better. Filter it with the gas mask. Please, do, guys, do not break my gas mask. It's, it's okay. It survived. Every time I give them something, I'm like, please don't break it. Please don't break it. It doesn't kill us, makes you stronger, but it's time just a little bit longer. Dirty ears. Shouldn't be much of a problem, just to be sure. Dibs on the gas mask. <laughs> Mary Jane needs more food. And that's it. Just Mary Jane needs... What is that? Is she holding a gun? Or a water bottle? Or an upside-down boot? I don't know. These, these people. I don't know what's going on. Alright, Timmy, you're going out. You're the most expendable member here. Take the gas mask. Live long and prosper. Let's go. Just being realistic, guys. Timmy is the most expendable. Wada, wada, wada. Everybody needs wada. Wada, wada. I probably should have given T Timmy some water before he left. Yeah, let's listen to the radio. Let's listen to emergency radio broadcast. Why not? We might learn something. Let's see what we learned. We were able to get a weak signal and tap into the government's emergency announcement service. And guess what? Great news! The fallout outside is mostly gone. Yay! Which means I don't need the gas mask anymore. Mary Jane is good, 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 good. Ted's stomach is rumbling, but he'll be okay. He will survive. We thought it'd be a great idea to some role-playing fun and create our own sheltered theater group. We call it the Thunderdome. <laughs> We spent the rest of the day trying to write a script for a performance. We almost got into a fight over it and decided that maybe we would be blessed. Would be blessed. Would be best to play something simpler. Like a car. I don't know why that doodle. Military is transmitting in. They said their first step is to locate any remaining survivors. A plane will be doing a sweep over and we're gonna signal them with our flashlight. Do it! We're gonna get out of here. We're gonna survive. Hey, Timmy's back. Yeah! Everything was going as planned, but then the flashlight stopped working. What? Okay, we fixed it just in time to hear the distant roar of the plane's engines. We're pretty sure the pilots saw us. Let's see if they get back to us. But Timmy is back from the wasteland and is safe with us now. We used to visit our local cinema so often that we could travel there blindfolded. It wasn't that surprising when this was where our feet took us, almost without involving our brains in the process. And you found food! We recognize the sign of the food stand sticking from between the rubble. We were hoping to find some popcorn. <laughs> there was none, but the tomato tomato soup dispenser was still working. What? There's... There's theaters somewhere where they have tomato soup dispensers? Man, get on their level, my, my movie theaters. Like, tomato soup, gosh. Why don't you have it? Cinna had a strict policy of not bringing, not bringing your own drinks into the movie hall. Seems like somebody broke the rules a little. We found a lot of bottles in the last row of the hall. Some were even full. And our gas mask was damaged. That's okay. We don't really need it anymore. Dolores, you're going out and you're taking... You're taking... You're taking the lock. Take the lock. Knock somebody over the head with it. Timmy didn't say a word about it, but when he was outside, he scratched his hand on a wire. Some other rusty piece of metal. The wound is not looking pretty, and we need to do something about it. Cut it off! Cut it off! Timmy was very bright about the idea of cleaning his wound with a heated axe blade. What did you heat it with? It was a bit painful, but it was soon over. The axe is in no shape to be used again, but Timmy seems much better. Mary Jane is hungry. Okay. Mary Jane needs food. Ted needs... No. Timmy needs water. Okay, food, water. I'm so confused. There are only so many things you can do in a tiny bunker, so we thought, hey, why not play some games? We're not... Wait a second! I picked her up with her saxophone. Why doesn't she play us some music? What happened to her saxophone? Okay, so I think we just converted our bug spray into a med kit. We did! We did it! We are scientific geniuses, and Mary Jane has come back. Our little trip to the surface might have been spotted and followed. We should be more careful. The silent lace was at least one 
had at least one random resident who managed quite well. It was a proud-looking monkey. We had no idea where it came from. The zoo, maybe? It seemed very friendly. After getting a few pats on the back, the plain friendship started following us. So we got two pets now. Our monkey companion ran away only to come back moments later carrying a can of food! Thank you, monkey companion! I needed that so badly! Oh! Yes, two cans! Thank you, monkey! Monkey, you're my favorite. And we also found water. For whatever reason, this... All this stuff that I don't want to read. Mary Jane needs food. Jimmy needs drink. And Ted needs food. So food, food. I said food. Drink. Be ye fed, each and every one. Oh man, I don't, I don't really want to send Ted out. Okay, Ted. Ted. No, we can, we don't need an expedition right now. We got, we're good on food. We're closed off in a tiny shelter, and our supplies are very limited. If we want to survive, it's time for desperate measures. We know there's a group of elderly people hiding in the. Okay, steal from the elderly. Let's do it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's the only way for me to beat the game. And there's a bloody hand on the wall. Oh, that has nothing to do with our trip to the... What? Why did... Why did you steal a gas mask from the old people? We didn't need a gas mask, we needed food! Because now everybody's hungry! Oh, these people. Still nobody up. I'm not sending Ted out because for some god awful reason, if Ted dies, everybody loses. Our situation is getting worse every day. We can see the hunger and desperation in each other's eyes. We know a teacher from a local school rescued a bunch of kids when the bomb fell. We also know that what kind of supplies are in the school shelter as part of the community. We help stock it for an emergency. So technically, they're ours, right? Yeah! Totally! Yeah! That's totally how that works. Well, we got food from it, so whatever. Everybody looks fine. So you don't get anything. Jimmy, go out there and take the lock again. Lucky lock. Always take the lucky lock. Pancake came back and today was very agitated about something. He really wanted us to go out and follow him somewhere in the neighborhood. Take the map. Go with him. As a well-prepared hiker, oh, a well-prepared prepared hiker always takes a map. That's what we always say. Thanks to our trusty atlas. Atlas? That's a map. That's not an atlas. An atlas is like a book that, like, has things in it. Or am I thinking about an almanac? An almanac has, like, a list of, I don't know. So I'm going to stop talking now. Take a look at the devastation of our town and get back home, or rather, our shelter, just in time for dinner. Pancake tagged along for a while, but left before we got to the bunker. Before we got back, we were able to take a detour and get some cans! Yes! Mary Jane needs a drink, and Ted needs a drink. Sorry, Mary Jane, you're underage. All you get is water. <gasps> no! Jimmy lost our bad luck. We've lost our lucky lock. We're gonna die! We keep finding spiders everywhere. They're in our soup. They're in our water. Smack them with the Boy Scout manual. Woohoo! What? Did, how do we get food out of that? Soon, some spiders, few precise hits, and suddenly every spider was aware of the world of what the word decimation means. We also found a misplaced soup can while hunting these pesky spiders. How do you misplace a soup can? under a nuclear holocaust when you are all starving how do you misplace a soup can gosh these people Timmy needs water Ted is fine so get, get some, was it only water I didn't actually need it yeah it's just water gosh these people oh man I didn't even read that I hope it wasn't something important I needed Timmy's good. Dolores needs water. Okay, fine. Mary Jane, where are you? Oh, is that Mary Jane? Ah, oh, Mary Jane! Yay! Oh no, and she's crazy. She went crazy because I wouldn't let her plant radioactive seeds. Why? Day 48. We're doing pretty good, but we're running out of food. Oh no. 
I just heard a gunshot and now Mary Jane is gone. The enemy stormed into our shelter, but instead of grabbing our supplies, they got Mary Jane. She put up a fight and kept fighting her kidnappers furiously. We hope they don't hurt her. Oh, no. Well, that was an, en an encounter that I've never been in. They're requesting a representative from our survivor group to meet them in a specified location nearby. Seems they wish to question people before they evacuate us from the area. Oh, I don't know how this is going. Alright, Ted, let's see. Okay, Ted is back. He didn't die. And he didn't get sick. That's good. We managed to make it to the meeting in time. We tried our best to answer the questions the soldier asked us. Let's hope we fulfilled their expectations and our ragged appearance didn't make a bad impression. Timmy needs to eat and drink and Ted is hungry. We are not going on an expedition in this state. We're checking out a radio broadcast now. Day 54. We're doing good. We were able to tune in and get rid of just how static to listen to a very energetic and lively speaker. He seemed well informed and mentioned a few helpful tips that should make it easier for us to survive the next expedition. I can't speak. And everybody is fine. Nobody needs anything. We're not going on an expedition. It's not happening. We only have one person who's- Oh no, I heard another gunshot. Oh no. What is happening? We watched Hubble say those cruel dogs took Timmy out of the shelter. Oh no! What is happening? We're just- Alright, we're going on the- Can we even go on an expedition? Alright, we're gonna find out if we can even go out on an expedition when there's only one of us here. What is happening? Alright, Ted. Ted, go out. Just go. That's the end? Is that it? Well, nobody told me that Ted couldn't... We couldn't go out if Ted is the only one. Oh. When we couldn't get inside the shelter, we knocked, we screamed, we tried to pull the trap door open. Nothing worked and no one replied. This is either the sickest joke anyone ever played, or people inside are even more scared than we are. So we got knocked out of our own shelter. Oh man, that sucks. We made it to 61 days. An unknown force took over our shelter. Well. This has by far been... You were driven away. That's, that's a new... This has never happened to me before. This is a new experience. Well, this has certainly been my most successful recorded version of... 60 seconds. Somehow it all just went downhill immediately as soon as Mary Ga Mary Mary Gain Mary Jane got taken. I don't know what was going on. How I could have prevented that? I I don't know. If you guys know, let me know in the comments below. And if you like this video, make sure you leave a like. If you're not subscribed already, make sure you do because I put on new content like this every single day except for Sunday, which happens to be the day I'm recording this right now. Just so you know. I don't know when this is gonna be posted. It might not be till next week. I don't know. Probably just gonna cut that part out. I don't know. Anyways. With all that said, I will see you guys in that very nice car. That is a nice car. And also in this guy's. Bye. I trust you. I thought you were creepy at first, but now you're kinda cute and you like my toys, so why not? It has to be darker. Shut the doors completely. If I could get in, I would.